Hello everybody, this is just a uh, simple tutorial on how to set up your OBS with your test cam model 12, 16 or 24 on Windows. Like I mentioned, this is just a simple setup, um, not too complex, uh, as is uh, the audio that I'm getting to sending to OBS is just a stereo mix of, you know, of from the test cam. Okay, so once we have everything installed, you know, from the drivers, all the drivers installed in the, so I'll leave a link in the description box. So you, once you have here, so you go to Windows Control Panel, you go to Sound. It's a setting that uh, you have to make sure. So it's in the playback here. Find the test the test cam to here. Double click. Just make sure that the the, the the sample rate is universal between the, uh, on on the computer and to the the test cam, because if it if it's mismatch, you get that area when you're trying to record into onto SD card. So let's make it easy. So it's 24 bit, 48 hertz. Apply, yes. And then uh, do that same to the recording. Let's find it again. Advance. And uh, just go to, uh, so on the default, it says 12 channel. So we don't want this. So we want to keep it simple. Two channel. 24 bit 48 hertz and okay so once that is set up so let's go to OBS so you go to uh, so the sources plus audio input capture and the come names I'll write a test cam model 12 because I'm using that one and for the device, let's go to find the test cam. Let's bring it down here and make it there. Yeah, so that's here now. So it's set up on OBS. Now let's change angles and uh, set up the, the test cam. So, okay. So to go to menu, scroll down to system and then scroll down to USB audio and make sure to change it to stereo mix once that you can just go back and uh, meet up now that the test game is set up I'm gonna go back to my OBS just to build this and turn this down so when I engage it, uh, it doesn't explode. And while I'm here, I'm just going to quickly copy this audio capture into my other scenes. So I'll just right mouse click in the sources, place, reference. Okay, done. So I've connected my phone into channels 9 and 10 via the TRRS. So I'll play some music now. Check the, yep. And you'll see the, that signal is coming through into the mixer. So let's engage domains. And engage domains. And you cannot, probably cannot hear it. It's the reason why, it, so let's unmute this. And you can hear it now, yeah? So let's go back to... Let's go back to the main scene with this... Uh, the post record. So if, if it's engaged, now when I change... Put out the, the feather, it's gone. So now when I disengage this, this mixer will not work. 
but the volume coming to OBS will be based on uh, this fader. So when I disengage this, it will be a little bit louder. Okay, if I come it up, nothing happens. But if I do this, it's, of course it's going to uh, affect the, the signal coming to OBS. So let's quickly engage this again. Again. Music, no music. And when I do this, it's going to affect it, of course. So music. Okay. So this section is on how to send your your audio from, for example, your VLC or, or Spotify to, uh, to your test cam. Um, the reason why you want to do this is that uh, you have, if it's sending to the test cam, you can control all the volume, you know, using one feather. You know, instead of uh, going to the program and then changing it through there. Um, because, of course, you can uh, send the video and you know, VLC player audio or Spotify audio straight into OBS. Uh, it depends up to you. And, of course, if you have a stream deck, there's, uh, you can use that to control the audio, the VLC, and the Spotify, and so on. But anyways, if you want to send from uh, VLC to Tascam, this is how you do it. So I have this playing in the background, a song playing Oh, this a photo change screen. So I have a song playing in the background to send it to the test camps. Click here, open sound, this window will pop up. And go to volume, advanced sound options. Find the VLC player and go to output. And then pick the test cam. Pick the test cam. So it's sending it to the test cam. So let's set up the, the test cam to so we can receive it. So just letting you know that the, the, the USB audio uh, coming out for the PC uh, goes into the test cam on channels 1 and channel 2. And let's take a look at the meters. So I'll quickly show you. I'll change to the, the meter rating into uh, PC audio. Go to channel one and you see signal coming through. So that's the audio from the from the VLC player. So let's change it to the Yep. And then uh, let's we need to engage uh, the mode into PC. And you can see that uh, it's getting signal into the, the channel strip. Now let's uh, engage the mains. And when you go OBS, see, so we get signal now. Because the USB audio is coming into one and two, uh, that means that if you need to add a microphone, it's better to put it from three on onwards. But if you feel that you need as much of the channels as possible, you know, then you can always upgrade to model 16 or 24. Or you can um, always, you know, uh, instead of using the two channels, the one and two, you can always disengage uh, one of the, the USB channels. And then it will save you one extra one. It's going to turn it up. I'm going to turn it up and you can... Yeah. I hope uh, this tutorial helps with, uh, you know, uh, setting up OBS because I've seen a lot of people asking questions and uh, there is a, uh, a a manual on how to set this up, you know, exactly very similar to this on the OBS, not OBS, uh, test cam website. So hope everyone learned something. Any questions, leave in the comments below.
Till next time.